The Platinum 2499 is really a, a grail amongst grails for, for anybody that's into de vintage watches, in particular into paddocks. Five or six years ago, when I first really started to get into vintage watches, you know, I, I heard about this watch, you know, it, it was almost lore, even back then. This is most likely the most coveted trophy and legendary wristwatch in private hands. What we have here in front of us is the one and only Platinum Patek Philippe Reference 2499 in private hands. We knew it was in the collection of Eric Clapton, but we never thought we would see it publicly for sale. We never thought we'd be able to handle it, to touch it, to even have the opportunity to buy it. And now here we are, Christie's has, has been able to consign it from, from Eric directly. It's one of two white metal 2499s in the world. There are, there are no white gold 2499s. There are only two platinum 2499s. The other one belongs to the Paddock Philippe Museum. Both of these originally belonged to the Stearns. But then in 1989, when uh, the auction, the anniversary auction came about, the Stearns you know, graciously gifted one of these uh, to the sale back then. And that's how it kind of went into public hands. I know this watch since 1989. I dream of this watch. And since 1989, I want to touch it and have it and sell it one day. This dream nearly a quarter century uh, later comes true. We have an auction estimate of 2.5 to 4 million francs on it. That's about 2.7 to 4.2 uh, million US dollars. We never thought we would see it. Um, and the watch is so good on, on its own that it doesn't even matter that Eric Clapton owns it or that he's consigning it directly here. The watch would make, you know, it, it's, it's a watch of, of, you know, grandiose proportions no matter what. And the fact that, that uh, Christie's was able to consign it and is now offering it publicly is just, just fantastic.